But hey guys, what's up? It's Maximo here. Today I'm with the fam, aka James. And today we're going to give you guys the best life trick in the world. So as you guys know, tomorrow is the solar eclipse. And glasses all over the world are sold out. So today, me and James are going to show you guys how to make homemade solar eclipse glasses. So what you're going to need is a cereal box, scotch tape or any kind of tape, tin foil, scissors, and paper. That's it. That's all you need. But anyways, guys, let's get straight into this video. solar eclipse happens somewhere on the planet every 18 months or so, but the one we'll experience on August 21st is extraordinary. And then you're set, and then all you're going to do when the sun's out. Oh, and you look through there. You look exactly, that's right. And okay. That's why I say the sun's going to be at your back. Oh. And it's going to be, you hold it, yeah. And you look right through there, that's the screen. Oh, and I thought you sun, had a piece of paper out like this. No, no, the, sun, the piece of paper in there, the sunlight goes through that little tiny hole. A little tiny hole. And you get a projection of the eclipse sun right in the right on the white paper that's inside the cereal wow, box. Wow, this is yeah. cool. And then they... First, what you're going to do is you're going to take the cereal box, okay? What you want to do is you want to open it up. Thank you, sir. Much. Actually, for, for this, I'll, I'll take the smaller scissors since i got to make small cuts. No big scissors. All right, so what you want to do, guys, is you want to cut basically a square here and a square here, okay? So, Max, you want to go ahead and, and take care of that. Basically, you're going to cut that off, that off, and this end off on both sides. So, Max is going to cut that off, and while he's doing that, I'm going to get the tin foil out. Don't need a very big piece. Matter of fact... Half of this would work just fine. That's all you're gonna need is about a piece that big. So let's discard that. Where's those other scissors? Big scissors. All right. So you threw them. You threw them. Great. He threw the scissors. Wonderful. Big scissors. Small scissors. Okay. So what you're gonna do is you want to cut a piece of paper, basically as big as the bottom of that box is. So I'm just gonna guess this is right, and I can adjust it once Max finishes cutting this box maybe before the solar eclipse happens one eternity later okay show them there we go perfection now we need to put this at the bottom of that box i can't even look at let me see let me see if my my calculations are way off all right where's some scissors i'll do it i'll show you guys okay I'll show you the easy way to do this yeah make sure it's exact. it can be a little bit smaller like a little bit smaller than the bottom of the box is <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Now you want to stick that inside the box and tape it. There's one issue though. What? Look. Nope, that's not what it's for. See? He doesn't know the trick yet. Alright guys. So you need to open up the box and where's our piece of paper? Okay, my suggestion to make this easier is put a piece of tape like on both sides now so you don't have to do it once it's in that box. Maybe a little easier to do. Or maybe it won't. We'll find out. All right. So you want to take that piece of paper, get it all the way in the bottom. Pretty, pretty not a good job, guys. That's not how you do it, okay? <laughs> Definitely not a good job. Okay. Bam. That's what it looks like, guys. White on the bottom of the box. Let me see. That's it. You gotta get the white on the very bottom. You can't be doing anything. If it's not white on the bottom, fix it. If you don't, you're gonna go blind. Tape the, tape the box shut now. Hey guys. Tape those flaps closed. And I take the flaps on the top that you have not cut, close them, take the tape. Perfect. I can get the tape. Okay, I got the tape. Boom. Now look, you guys. Now make sure to tape a little bit more. Wait, my tape is. Okay. I'm not gonna tape. Make sure it's not lopsided, guys. You gotta make sure. All right. You gotta tape this good because if you don't tape it good, you're gonna go blind. That's how you take the tape, put it here, go around, bam. Now I do suggest using Cocoa Pebbles box for this, yeah. but it really doesn't matter I because it's all the same, but I like Cocoa Pebbles. Well, so. I just want to use Fruity Pebbles, but Cocoa Pebbles are better. Perfect. All right, now what you're gonna do is on one side, guys, I guess depends which way you wanna look, you're gonna cover one side with tin foil, basically like this, and once you get that tin foil nice and snug, you're gonna tape all around it really good. So put a big piece there, right there. No, 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 on the corners, on the edges. On the corners. You don't want to do it on the middle, guys. You want to do it on the, the edges. Not the middle. Corners. See, like, boom. Boom. 
Take that, and then you can just go all the way around if you want. All right, guys, that uh, that, that pretty much does it. So now you got uh, like pretty much done. One last step, okay? Now you may want to take something other than scissors, uh, maybe like a pencil or a pen, but I don't have a pencil or a pen on me right now. What you want to do, guys, is you want to make a hole right in this tin foil. Doesn't have to be too. Well, let me let me open this up and make it like this. Okay, uh, you kind of want to make it like a normal round hole. It does not have to be perfect, but that's my hole. Good enough, and we're done. That's it, guys. Now, what you're gonna do is when you see the solar eclipse, let's pretend you guys are the solar eclipse. You're the sun right now. Okay, we don't want to look at the sun. We want to turn our backs to the sun. What you're going to do is on this side right here that's open, you're going to look in here, okay? And you're going to perfectly see the solar eclipse. What happens is it comes right through here. It reflects right off that white paper and it's almost like you're going to be watching a movie. Best part, doesn't hurt your eyes. You're not looking at the sun, but you get to watch the eclipse and you don't have to go buy no dang glasses. What do you think? I think it's pretty good. I mean, you just look through here and this whole eclipse will happen on the end of your cereal box. Hey, you can't beat that for free. I mean, most people have this stuff right now in their house. So get out there, go make your glasses, get ready for the solar eclipse tomorrow. Do you know what time it's supposed to happen at? No, we don't either. Whoa. What? I just saw the solar eclipse. You did? Oh, is your eyes all right? I used my box. That's smart, bro. That is smart. That way you don't lose your vision. No, I can watch the solar eclipse. Bro, that's awesome. I gotta make one now. I, I need to watch the solar eclipse. Do you have any more cereal boxes? They're cheap. Let's go get some cereal. Let's go. I want some Fruity Pebbles. Come on, let's go get some Fruity Pebbles.